here for the uh, 2019 Wood Booger Geo Tour. Yay! And um, we're on top of the Flag Rock uh, Recreational Center, but, uh, Recreational Area Overlook. Way up on top of this hill. So, um, as you can see, it's really pretty and really way up high. And we're excited to, to uh, start this Geo Tour. So tomorrow at 9 a.m. we have to meet for the beginning and um, there's like 25 caches and if we find them all we get like a wood booger geo coin which i'm excited about because i personally love shh, no <laughs> okay yeah. anyway yeah in case you don't know what a wood burger is that's another name yes. for bigfoot in this area yes. so anyway um we'll welcome you to come along with us and um hope we can have some hope fun. we get the coin tomorrow Woohoo! Yeah. look at this beautiful countryside look at the mountains you can't even appreciate it here even in 4k in the town and the mountains. The sun's going down, so it's like really cool. Anyway, and then we're gonna show you a statue that's right near here. Just another view of the town. We were down there driving and then the, the event we gotta meet at yeah, the we gotta meet at the event over here at a grill and then there's a bunch in town. Wow, little flag right there if you can see it. It looks really high when you get on there and looking from the town. All right. So. Oh my dirty! That was. Yeah. Whoa, I didn't even look down there. I didn't look it down here when I was coming when I was coming up. But when you go across this bridge and you look down there, I can't see the bottom. It goes in between these rocks. All right, I can see the bottom. That would hurt. That would kill you. Huh. It's crazy. Look at them feet. Alright. Look at his butt. <laughs> so, we are going to um, do this geo tour, and um, this is our friend for the weekend, and maybe we'll see him, you never know. But I'm all excited, today. and we will start doing this tomorrow. Okay, yes. so here we are. It's uh, early in the morning. Well, not early. Almost 8.30. 30. <laughs> and uh, there's a geocache event here, the Woodburger event kickoff at 9 o'clock, and we're heading in now to kickoff event. Yay! Kick event. So Let's we're go. here to uh, begin <laughs> trying to find 20 some odd caches today so we can get a cool geo coin. Let's go. Yeah. 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 If it wasn't for the creative minds of our friends, a lot of what you see today would just be a simple birdhouse like I did the first year. <laughs> Thank you all. Again, Rick said I'm Joe Pablis, the mayor of Norton, and I cordially welcome you to the city of Norton and to the third annual Wood Booger Deal. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do with the chicken? It's that was it. Oh, you think it's good? That was game pieces. Yeah. 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 I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, we signed it. I did it for you. Thank you, sir. And they got the little, little big Pac Mans. And they got numbers on them. The teeth are numbers. And then you use it for the combination. Which has already been opened. About that one is you have to pull that cable down, and up above you, up in the air, is that uh, oh, one that will open and give you the combination, but you can't see it while you're oh, pulling the cable down. There. Yeah, yeah. Ah. Oh. <laughs> All right. Look at this <laughs> intricacy here. This is so cool. Yeah, I had just a little. Yeah, yeah. Uh -oh. Pop up in there with pop off. Oh. 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 Strike, strike one, strike two. This could be a strike three. Hey, James. Open this end. Open this end, Open this end, remember. Oh, 
You should know how to use those. That's all. Oh. Oh. Did that get you finger? I told you there's a dog in here to bite you. Oh, boy. Look here. Oh boy. Well, you need to so there is no strike go, three. You need to go get something out of your bag and put it in. Remember, we never take anything unless we replace. One thing about doing a geo event like this, a geo tour, is that there's always a lot of people around. So sometimes you don't got to solve them. Sometimes you do. In this case, we do. Oh, look at that. It's a sign. I was. Oh, is it just shoved behind the sign? Okay. Not so much a... Oh, it's even got a little wood piece on it to look like it's part of the sign. Oh, wow. <laughs> Itchy! <laughs> Alright, the magic word is Sito. C-I-T-O. The word because it's a day. Because it's a trash thing. I get it. So you're saying cherry and strawberry need to switch? Yeah. Here we are going to stage two of a the nose nose to you, Cash. How is everyone? Hi. Hi. <laughs> Doing great, Hello. Hey. Yeah, it smells bad. Kind of fun though to follow people because you kind of know if you're on the right track. <laughs> okay, we're heading to the TB Checkable Hotel. Is that what I meant to say? The Woodbooger Checkable Hotel. <laughs> so, which is really cool. We brought a bunch of trackables. So. Um, We can put them in there. Fresh, fresh tar and sealer. Sealer. Oh, that is so cool. Let's get, let's get Bigfoot in there. <laughs> oh, let me see. I'm sorry. Bigfoot. Can you see? Heading out towards our top of the mountain, boogity boogity. Yummy. Uh, deer cash. So, uh, got the kids with us now. On the camera, man. Flag rock up at the top of the mountain. What's so funny? There we go. All right, you guys figure out how to open it. Here we go. She just came first. Oh, I thought it was a bad box. You just walked through the woods. Whoa, well, that was an easy what one. That? It's a poly bee. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Um, a hug. There's no lock on it though. Give me a hug. Boogity boogity. Ew. Ew. <laughs> it's a stripper. It's a penny. Oh. Well, that's. Yeah. I'll give you that. He's like, nope, you guys can't get over there that way. You gotta go this way. We're like, awesome. You have new friends, they're gonna follow you. <laughs> So, that's what's on the 16 o'clock news now. Watch out. Stop, Jerry. Coming through. No. Jerry, stop. It's going to slip. Uh, yeah, Jerry, no. We're going to fall in high. Everybody move. I can never be a parent. We're on a new adventure. This is called. Whoa! What are you. I'm gonna die. This is the. Yesterday. Look at this. This is the same thing. Keep going. I wanna go in the cave. This is cave diving with Jeremy. What? On the 4 o'clock news. Motor 16. Mm, not anymore. It's not 4 o'clock. Wow. Bigfoot? Is he home? No. That's a good shot. Anyways, I'm bored now. Bye. <laughs> We're going to call good. again because we can't find one. <laughs> Alright. There's nobody around to help us, so... It's a tie. I mean, it's a, a thing. Is that it? Oh. 
No, that can't be right. There's got to be more to it. What is all this stuff? <laughs> Feels like I'm getting electrocuted or something. Say I'll sign it. What is? I don't understand why this one's so easy. Way to throw the bottle cap down. Huh? Okay. Well, that was not much of a gadget. I guess we'll move on to the next one. Look, it's got this wire up here that makes you feel like you got you know, these all like red herrings, and it's like just open the thing. <laughs> <sighs> all right, the moving thing. on. All right, multicast stage one. Uh, cords took us to the middle of the grass, <laughs> but look, it's not. It's over here. Let's see about this one. Ooh, let me look. Four six one eight. Hey, how come you have a code? You gave us a code. Put it in the right order. Yeah. All right, so we opened it up and found this. Yeah, you to get the combination when they give it to you, but cheapers. Now we got a word cache. So, is there any hints? We'll have to look for a hint. Hold on. So we had stage one, and we're on stage two. Why? I hope I. Oh. Got found our way back. Oh, that was the one that got us lost for more than an hour. Oh, wow. This, this is, um, oh. Look at him. Oh. I'm slipping and sliding. Oh. Yeah, let's go down the street. Down the street. <laughs> we gotta find an entrance way down the street. Which is down the street. Oh, cool. hey, Amanda's missing the lake. Come in. Imagine coming down here and losing your brakes. <laughs> that would be like really crazy. This is so pretty. Yeah, I'm not driving down this road. <laughs> I don't even want to drive up the road. Wow, this is really pretty. You can see geocachers in the distance. <laughs> but we're up here on this trail, looking for stage two of a multi. <sighs> Which is it's probably under that rock. <laughs> And the reason I'm not climbing this rocket because I hurt my ankle yesterday. And I don't want to aggravate it. Oh man, I can't get up there to see it. Alright. Whoa. Alright, so she got the combination. Now she's got one of those letter things which you probably can't see and I don't want to go up this hill. I see yanks it apart. All right, some of these are pretty far away, so we're heading on down this. At least it's a nicely shaded path right along the water side. This big reservoir up here in the top of this mountain. <sighs> At least the path is straight and not uphill. All right, we found one in a spigot. It's a, it's a fake spigot. Check out the view. If the kids knew this was here, they'd be over here tumbling down this hill. I hope there's a way over here because... The reservoir's not too high, so it's not flowing down. Yeah, we're not sure if we can get over there, but there's some caches over here. Let's see. So here we are at a cache, move over honey, that says it takes two. And if you look, there's part up in the one tree and part down here with a whole bunch of locks. And 
I'm <laughs> pulling things. Pull something, honey. Let me see if something shows up there. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, honey. <laughs> That's pretty cool. <laughs> I'm just sitting over here relaxing. <laughs> anyway, so we're going to do that and let's see what's in there. Yay! Uh oh, it's inside. Yay! All right. That was cute. So these are some really neat gadget caches we're running into. Well, the one thing about this geocaching thing that's doing in the woods, <sighs> a lot of it's downhill, but then you realize you got to go back uphill to get back to where you're going. So this has been and is a major workout on the car and the people. But if we survive, I guess we're stronger for it. Should have known better. It's called a film canister in the woods, something you would hate to have to see something small like that. And then I approach it and uh, I can't get across this log. Okay, go. Mm. That is the smallest film canister I've ever seen. Look at that. <laughs> I find that kind of hilarious. Ta -da. Oh my gosh. It's got a writing utensil on it already. <laughs> Now look at the log. The log is like a giant roll of paper. <laughs> look at that. That's hilarious. All right, let's sign it. The miserable climb uphill. Miserable. Taking mini breaks, taking mini breaks. As we pant to take mini breaks, look, we're halfway up. What nice mountainside. <sighs> All right, so we are finally at the last one, hopefully. And I think it's... <laughs> Believe! Oh, this is put here by the guy that gave us his path tag earlier. The guy we were with this morning. All right, now we got to figure out... How these gadget caches work. Can you read the instructions? Okay. Believe. There's a dowel missing, but is that supposed to be? I believe you can figure out how to gain access. No tools needed to access entry. Please be gentle. Okay, hold this. All right. <laughs> We, we did it. All right, this is our um, the last one we actually need we to get, get our GeoCoin. I'm so excited. Okay, so um, our fun weekend of hiking and geocaching and all that fun stuff is coming to an end, but we did want to end this video. This is the day after we recuperated and we wanted to show the coin that we got and everything from yesterday. Mm -hmm. We wanted to close that out. So what do you got to say? I'm just going to say that a yearly event so if anyone wanted to come out here and do this next year that it happens every year um, it was a great bunch of people we were with and um, we went around and did a whole bunch of geocaches with them together then we had to come back here and get our kids and we lost the crowd we ended up going up to the mountain um, there's two stages pretty much some down in the town and then some on the mountain and we did the second oh, wow. stage up on the mountain with our family. Yeah, you so. saw all that already. <laughs> well, you might want to. So what do you suggest, honey, you do before you come out here? <laughs> you better work out. You better be in low. Well, we, we survived, so I guess it's okay. It's a lot of up yeah, It's and a down. lot of walking up. But anyway, it was, it was good. And yeah, there was a good turnout. They, I think they said more. This is the third year, more this year than the previous two years. So um, it was a great turnout. Yeah, and, uh, no matter where we went, even throughout the day, even though we took a break, we were still yeah. running into geocachers all day. Up and, and it's down really the helpful too. They helped us with a couple and we helped them with a couple. So that was Yeah, really you get nice the trade too. information a little. <laughs> so show us what we won or what we qualified. We had to find 25 out of 27 and coin. this is what we got. So we got this cool, so a little closer. A wood booger guy. A wood booger, Bigfoot is what they call it. And uh, anyway, on the back it's got cool scenery. And everything. It's a really nice coin. Heavy duty. Yeah. Yeah, of course it's trackable, but you know we're not letting it yeah, go. This so. is my coin. <laughs> anyway, so 
Yeah, we came, we saw, we conquered. This is what we came for, and uh, we had a great day doing it, and we survived it. And, and make sure you come with a car that's going to go up very steep hills. Very steep hills. Climbing that mountain. Is, <laughs> very I mean, steep hills. Okay. Make sure you check your brakes. <laughs> my wife asked me, "What if? can you imagine going up these hills with a manual? Uh, Transmission? I don't know. I don't know. It is. There are times you might have to slow down, and it's, yeah, it's crazy. I wouldn't want to do that. Anyway, it was a great time. I hope you enjoyed watching what we did, and uh, we had a great time. And thanks so much. Hopefully, we'll, hopefully, we'll come back next year. Yeah, we want to do it again maybe next year. It took us about eight hours to get here, so it was good though. It was fun. Anything else you want to say? No. All right, thanks for watching. Cash on. See you later.